Hello and welcome to the League of Gamers. I know it's been a while, but I am back because I am now free from exams completely. It's half term and I don't have oh loud loud noises. I don't have anything to do until college starts again. So I am going to be back making some more videos. I'm probably not going to stick to the routine that I uploaded before I stopped making videos a while back, but I will hopefully be making some more videos. Um I can already tell that I'm rambling, that's because I didn't actually sleep last night, because I'm out of college, my sleep pattern has been completely fucked up, I, I went, I, if I'd have gone to bed last night, I would have gone to bed at about 7am, and that's just, it's not cool man, so I didn't sleep, uh, which means my brain is very, very unfunctioning, un un unfunctional, see what I mean, anyway, um, I'm going to move on to explaining to you what this game is. This game is currently in closed beta. Uh, yeah, as you can see down there, beta build. It is called Dirty Bomb. Uh, you can probably get some beta keys somewhere. A friend of mine gave it to me. And um, the only way I can describe this game is it's a mix between TF2 and Battlefield. It's, it's really fun. Uh, it has a class system like TF2 almost. Where you have snipers, heavies, uh, scouts, medics, that shotgun people, that kind of stuff. Um, and the way that the classes work is you can get classes. Th these are all the different um, classes you can play. Uh, she's a she's a medic. He's a I'm not even sure operation specialist uh, objective specialist. I I don't know. They all have their own unique abilities and you can choose three of these to go in a squad and once you're in game you can't change your squad but you can change between units in that squad oh pardon me just burped because i just drank like two liters of coke to make my brain awake enough to do this uh yeah so your loadout will be loadouts work kind of like csgo crates do except you can buy them with in-game currency rather than real money it's a thousand credits for um uh, a crate and a crate will give you any of these like I have I have a card for a character called proxy but I don't actually own proxy as a character so I have a I have a silver level card which is I think the second highest you can get it goes like uh, copper bronze iron is that it I can't remember something like that. copper bronze iron silver gold I don't know uh, yeah and then you can trade up but trade ups uh, cost 500 credits and I don't have enough to show you guys that you can also yeah this is where your cases go this is where your boosters go I'm gonna I'm gonna hurry up and just jump into the game because I'm, I'm talking quite a lot um, I've not even been in a competitive match yet oh oh, oh there's a tutorial now um, I'm not sure if that's new or if I just haven't been paying attention but yeah there's a tutorial now oops sorry I, I, I I thought I heard somebody getting in. Oh my god, wait, what? Okay, I'm imagining things. There's absolutely nobody else in the house apart from me. It's just me. Okay, anyway, um, quick join. Let's just, yeah, da, 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 all these maps, go. So yeah, it's in beta. There's Everything's not in the game yet. Uh, hello again. I don't know if you noticed, but I had to do a quick cut there because uh, my game froze when I attempted to join a lobby. And then it took me another five reboots of the game to actually find a server that wasn't full and that I could actually join. Because every time I tried to join, it just said, Oh, this server's full now. You can't join. And then refused to let me click cancel. So, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, it's not It's not a completely polished. Oh, that's a bad guy. Did I get the... Oh, I got the kill. Oh, yes. Okay. So, uh, we're on the attacking side of this. Which means we need to get that tank up there. Uh oh, that doesn't sound good. Uh, up there. Uh, to do that, we need to repair it. Um, what I'm holding here is an airstrike indicator. So if I chuck that over there, that should call in air support. You, you get XP just for calling in objectives and stuff like that. Okay, I've got a neutralized. Did I get anything else? No, okay, just got a neutralized. Oh no! Oh god, I'm I'm in the. I didn't know you could do. Oh, okay. I better shoot stuff. I don't seem to be okay. Uh, I wasn't able to shoot stuff. Never mind. 
yeah, um, we've just got to get that EV to the other end. The annoying thing about this is it's a lot easier to play on the enemy team at this point because they can just call in an airstrike like that and disable our EV because uh, you have to do damage to oh god, you have to do damage to it to get it to stop. Oh god, I'm gonna die. I'm so dead. Oh, please don't kill me. I think that there's a machine gun placement up there and I think somebody might be in it shooting me with a sniper or something. I'm gonna heal this up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Okay, one XP for repairing. Okay, so that should get a little bit of distance. I'm gonna run up here and see if I can... Okay, that, that red dot means a scout has found an enemy. Oh, oh god. Oh, I'm gonna move on the shot at. Oh yes, my indicator is back. Okay, I'm just gonna chuck it randomly over there because that seems like a good idea to me. I don't know if it's actually gonna do any good, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Did it hit anything? No, it literally did nothing. Oh god, he's down. Okay, uh, you can also uh, resurrect people. Oh, oh no, he died. Okay. Um, if you get to people within a certain time span, you can resurrect them. Medics can do it instantly with heal pads, with defibrillators, whatever. Oh god, there's, there's somebody between those crates that I can't forget. Yeah, also the sound's a bit... The sound's a bit laggy sometimes. Come on, come on, no! No, I need to get out, I need to get out, sorry. I'm taking too much damage. Can't deal with the heat, so I'm getting out of the kitchen. Give you repaired, okay, let's do this. Yeah, I've actually played, I've only played a couple of hours of this. Um, I downloaded this and then a friend of mine was like, hey, let's play CSGO. And since he said that about three weeks ago, my my work. time clock on CSGO has gone from 30 hours to 130 hours. So, um, yeah, I've been getting into CSGO pretty, pretty Thank you, man. at the moment. I wouldn't say I'm great at it, but that doesn't mean I can't try. Like 130 hours, it probably sounds like a lot. It's my most played game on Steam now, but... That's still not a lot of... Okay, the medic's got that guy. That's still not a lot of people. Oh, yeah, you can uh, you can wall run on this as well. Which makes... um. Yeah, people get up this thing, but I don't know how, because my jump always seems to put me backwards. Am I supposed to, like... Oh, yeah, I should probably actually do the objectives. God, I hope this isn't too bad to listen to, because... You can probably hear my fans whirring away. And also, um, oh, okay, I'm going to run under here. And also, the sound is really laggy. I, I, I think the game's just badly optimized at this point, but it is only in beta build. So, oh, God, oh. Okay, I got that kill, apparently. I'm going to finish off his dead body so nobody can res him. There you go, 50 extra XP. I think I'm, oh, I am actually out of ammo, so I'm going to drop myself some ammo. Just like every other uh, heavy weapon support thingy thingy. We have the objective. Okay, now we have the objective. I'm just going to chuck this over there. Because that seems like a good idea. Oh god, the sound is so laggy. If anybody knows a way to change the sound, I would be much appreciated. Because it, it, it doesn't usually sound like this. And before you say anything, it's got nothing to do with um, me recording. Because I'm recording on a... I'm not actually sure what I just did. Deliver oh, the bloody objective. oh I, I lowered the bridge. My, I, I recall onto a separate hard drive, so it has absolutely nothing to do with that. Okay, enemy spawn points. Okay, there's a lot of enemies. I'm just gonna hide. Drop myself some ammo while I'm at Oh, God, that could have hurt. Uh, the objective at the moment is to get that EMP thing over to the objective. So let's go ahead and... Okay, somebody else has got it. Enemy airstrike. Oh, 15 seconds till my airstrike's up, and then I can just nuke their base. Yeah. Oh, we win! Yeah. GG! Boom! Okay. We win! Mission accomplished. Mission nice accomplished. Fantastic. Okay. I got a fuck ton of XP for that. And I got a load of credits. Oh, okay, I got, I got first win of the day bonus and everything. Badges earned. None. Don't know what badges do. Okay. That's all cool. I'm going to return to main menu so I can show you how trade-ups work.
Because I'm not going to split this into two episodes because I don't think it's been long enough. C can I can I turn to menu, please? Oh, oh yeah. Uh, it'd probably help if I confirmed. Please, no crash, Arino. I think it just crashed on me. Did it? Did it just crash? I can't tell. Has it? Cr it's crashed. Okay. Um. Uh. Join me again in a couple of seconds. Oh. Hello, welcome back. Yes, as I said, my game did crash. This usually doesn't happen, but for some reason it seems to be happening a lot to me today. Uh, I don't know why. Uh, it does say that there's an update. Uh, I could probably read the patch notes and everything. I can't be asked right now, though. Featured Merc, Kira. I have no idea what Kira does. I think I might have a couple of cards for Kira. Anyway, I have enough for a trade up, so I'm going to show you trade ups while I can because I don't have enough to afford a full crate. Trade ups, trade ups, loadouts, and then go into trade up now. I do fire support. I give you ammo. I kill bad guys. I'm just lovely, really. <laughs> I love this guy. I love the Scottish accent. Uh, yeah, this is the guy I mainly play because I love the airstrike. I've got so many kills with it. And then, um, because I mostly only have copper levels, I'm going to level up to iron. Uh, okay. Don't even own that guy. So, uh, oh yeah, I've got to click and drag. Don't even own that guy. Can't use that guy. Don't own that guy either. Don't own proxy. So now I should be able to trade up and it will show you the wagon wheel of destiny. If it works, please work. Oh, yes. oh, okay. I got um something and some... Oh, what's this? Try hard. Gain 10 HP for each death you suffer without getting a kill up to a maximum of 30 HP. Okay, that's kind of useful, I guess, if I'm getting killed. Too bad. 20% reduction to reload time. That's quite useful. I like that. Okay, I might have to apply that. Um, Oh, God. Badly rendered. Um... Damage BR16 seems to be a little bit lower than the average, but rate of fire is way up there. I've ne cricket bat. <laughs> Great, I got a cricket bat. That's um, that's interesting. Cricket bat is that? Huh. I'm wondering if cricket bat's rare because I've never even heard of a cricket bat in this game. And I've played it for a few hours. I, I think I've got three hours on record now. So, yeah, range is good, stability and accuracy are down, but rate of fire is up, so this is more of a submachine gun than an assault rifle. The BR-16 kind of looks like, oh god, looks like it should be an assault rifle, but maybe you're supposed to fire it in, like, bang, bang, bang. Well, actually, no, if you're supposed to fire it in a low rate of fire, they wouldn't give you a high. I don't know, I'm, I think I'm trying too hard. Currently own one of these loadout cards, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so what other cards? Uh, I don't have enough for other trade-up, so let's go back to the barracks. What other stuff do I actually have? Yeah, this is my highest level for uh, Supreme Operative Silver KE12. Proxy, that's her name, Proxy. Uh, gives her really, really low damage uh, submachine gun with what looks a hell of a lot like a Tech 9 from CSGO. And a still not a stiletto. I don't. That, it looks like a shiv. It, it, it's just a kind of knife. Okay. Try hard, uh, the same one that my other card had a second ago. Pineapple juggler allows you to quickly pick up and throw nearby grenades. So that sounds quite useful if you're in like sprinting around in a combat situation. Double time allows you to reload while sprinting. That's really useful because I find maneuverability in this game is actually like quite a crucial part. You have to be able to get the hell out of the way of people's fire. People usually have quite a lot. Of, you usually have quite a lot of health, so you can withstand quite a lot of battering. So if you can get out of the way quick enough. You at least have a chance of running away, unlike some shooter games where you're just like, brow, dead. Like, there's, there's no escape. This one, you actually get second chances, which I think is why I like it. So, yeah, this, guys, is Dirty Bomb. Uh, when it comes out of closed beta, or if you feel like paying to get yourself into the closed beta, feel free, because it is an extremely fun game, and I cannot wait until they've actually fully patched it and optimized it and done all that stuff. And I cannot wait until I've actually saved up enough coins, because I think it's like 15,000 to get another Merc. Enough coins to buy a Sniper, because I love using Snipers on these kind of games. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys. This game has been more than enough trouble to edit, because it keeps fucking crashing. But I suppose that will just have to happen. Uh, I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.